covering Colorado first. All right, let's talk about the weather in this middle of the week with the man, the myth, the legend. There he is, Dave Aguilera. <laughs> hey, bro, well, thanks, Brian. I, I need to do the noon more often with you uh, around here. It makes me feel good. 78 degrees at the mousetrap right now. You can see a little of that haze. Usually you could really see the, the mountain silhouette uh, very vibrant out there, but that's hanging around here. It looks a little clearer from City Park. Looking at the city there, 79 degrees. Not a bad afternoon at all. 72 in Fort Collins and Lakewood, and we have 79 already in Centennial and Castle Rock. Warm up there. Satellite and radar together. Not much cloud cover at all. We've got just a few in the foothills. That is it. Most everybody in the state enjoying this nice clear day. The reason it's so clear now yesterday we had this cold front go through. It was dry and cool and now we have this high pressure area coming in from the desert. Now it's warmer and dry and that's really going to heat us up as we track the warmth of the ridge here. By the time it gets into New Mexico and Texas tomorrow, we get a more southwesterly push. Uh, today it's coming from the northwest here. That's cooler and then southwest tends to warm us up. We get a downsloping wind and it just kind of explodes briefly from Texas into the central Rockies on Friday and then by the weekend it retrogrades. It pulls back and shrinks down. That'll open the door for a little more cloud cover to move in and cooler temperatures too for Saturday and Sunday. But for today, man, uh, nice warm up, about 10 degrees warmer than what we had yesterday for most areas. 86 in Windsor and Greeley here. And those 80s shoot all the way down to the south. Checking out some of the neighborhoods here. Up in Laporte should be about 84, 85 in Campion, and uh, Fort Lupton should be right around 88 degrees in southern Weld County there. And then we look uh, further uh, south in Jefferson County. Indian Hills at 78, Lakewood, Edgewater, and Lakeside all should be right around 88 degrees this afternoon. For uh, Western Colorado, we're looking at 80s there, no 90s. That's good to see. 70s to near 80 in the mountains, and we'll be hitting the 90s down here in Pueblo, La Junta, and Lamar. A little hotter down there in that part of the state. So 87 out at DIA today with the hazy sun kicking in gear. And don't forget, we do have poor air quality. If you have any breathing issues, the air is unhealthy for sensitive groups, poor visibility, and it's an action day. We're asked to drive a little less and avoid idling if we can. 91 tomorrow a little warmer for us near 90 on Friday the sunshine holds on through the end of the week and then on Saturday 86 degrees we have an isolated storm chance in the afternoon but in the morning for the CU game when we take on Nebraska 70s for most of the game with mostly sunny skies not bad at all little change on Sunday for Broncos Sunday about 80 for the high temperature 20% chance of afternoon thunderstorms from halftime and beyond so we'll watch for that you might get a little wet if you're going to go watch the game and then Monday and Tuesday and into start of next week we'll be in the 70s and just a slight chance each day about a 10 to 20% chance of afternoon showers and thunderstorms coming your way. So all in all, not a bad weekend. We just got a little better chance of storms on Sunday. I don't think that'll stop the Broncos from smashing the rain. <laughs> whooping, smashing, yeah, whatever whooping adjective you smashing, want to say. Right? Yeah. yeah, it'll be a good one. It'll be a good one. Mm. All right, Dave, thanks. Excel yeah. uh, Energy's Dave Service is this Friday.